it finally took me a while to realize that the reason my videos were so blurry was because my camera lens needed to be cleaned. So I would clean it on one side of my phone, but I would not clean it on the other side, and that was my issue. So now that I have figured that out, hopefully my videos will look a little bit better. So um, today we are just doing schoolwork. So far I have cleaned up the um, kitchen somewhat. So I have um, done the dishes to clean the table off and um, I've already started a load of laundry in the laundry room. Um, so I have a lot of energy this morning. I have to get Rico to clean the blue table off and um, um, clean the floor. We got a new couch probably from the since the last time I did a video and um, Rico moved our TV up there which I asked him to do probably about two or three years ago and he told me he couldn't do it so that's crazy but now he can magically do it <laughs> um, so I'm not really sure what to do a video about but I figured I would just pick up the camera and go um, I don't want my channel to go too long without having a video up so um, lately let's see what have I been up to lately we have been homeschooling we started back the second week in July I think and the kids have been doing pretty well um, so far there is nothing yeah but um lately um, we have just been planning our school year which is since we homeschool year round we're still working on some things from last year and just adding on some things for this upcoming year um, I've been planning um, getting ready for um, me and Rico's our vow renewal is coming up in February and so I have been doing a lot of planning with that and I'll probably show you guys the stuff that I have already we'll be having a wedding for our 10 year anniversary since we um, when we got married we were only um, I was 19 and he was 20 we got married on his birthday and we basically just went to the courthouse so next year um, for our 10th anniversary we are going to have a vow renewal and so um, I can basically show you the things that I have already and kind of what we have planned and that'll probably be a pretty neat video so um, other than that we have just been relaxing um, I've only had one daycare kid here all week so and then last week I had my um, child care conference that I had to go to so it was my mom was here so it's kind of July has been pretty relaxing um, it's almost like I, I have like a vacation before August sets in so that's been pretty good but um, I'm gonna go ahead and get the kids started on their Bible lesson and then once I get them started with their individual work I will show you guys what I have um, what I have already purchased for our um, vow renewal ceremony and um, I will see you guys back in a bit. All right, so we have these two bins in this box so far with some things that I have. Um, let me close my door because the kids will probably get loud in a little bit. But um, so I'm gonna show you what's in this box and this tote and then that box and then this tote. So, in here we have, um, basically these are runners for the tables, and our colors are uh, black and white damask with a, like, turquoise kind of Tiffany bluish color. Um, I have a lot of these, but the only thing about these is that some of them are different sizes and shapes. Um, I just bought these used from someone on Facebook for probably about $10, I'm thinking. And it's just a whole bag full of different ones. Um, I have these for the kids that come. And it'll basically have 
some little things in there for them to do. I am going to have a children's room for the children to play in and have games and all sorts of fun stuff for them to do. Um, I have these invitations that I will be using for the rehearsal dinner. The invitations for the actual um, bar renewal will be coming in in probably about three or four weeks. I ordered them off of Etsy and they are being handmade. So, but these are the invitations for the rehearsal and rehearsal dinner. So, I have those and then, well, I got this from Oriental Trading. I'm not sure how much it was, not much at all. And I got these from um, Party City. So, I have that. I have this one tablecloth, and I probably bought this thing about two years ago because I have been planning this for a long time. It's a paper tablecloth. Not sure exactly what table it will go on. It might go on the table that Rico and I will be sitting at. Everybody else will just have a plastic white tablecloth, I'm thinking. I do have a wedding planner, and all of that is pretty much included in what she provides. This I got from Oriental Trading, but um, I actually, I got it and I paid for it, but let me show you guys what happened. So I got these glasses from Oriental Trading. They didn't have them long, but my one problem was that when this one came, it was cracked across the thing so it has our names and the day that we got married which was March 4th 2008 um, they didn't have any more so they couldn't send me another one so they just gave me a refund so basically I got these for free um, I have not had the luck of finding any more of these so we I mean you can probably still drink out of it it's probably fine so I mean I won't let it Bug. It bugged me a lot when I first saw it, but now that I'm looking at it again, it's not so bad. So it says Jaleesa and Rico, and it has March 4th, 2008, which was the year that we got married. So that will be going on our table. And I love it because it has the black and white. It's not really like a damask, but it has the swirl that will match the damask decorations. And then I have these, which I also bought um, from someone. It's just a whole bunch of favor bags that I will use at my candy buffet that I plan on having. And I'll just set these up. I'm thinking about getting something printed that says, thank you for coming, because that will probably be our favors for the Viral just the candy buffet. Um, let's see what else I have. I have these swatches that I got for my bridesmaids. Um, I will have about five bridesmaids and they will be wearing black dresses, like the T link type dresses. So I just got these to look at the color. And this, I just bought it cause it's pretty and it has our colors and um, even though our caterer does provide the plates and cups and everything for um, for the reception, uh, we'll probably just use this for our table for me and Rico. So that we will have our own plates. Okay. And then next, I have these little things, little diamonds that this, I'm thinking this will probably go on the table with the cake. So I might look back at this video to remind myself what I'm doing with all of these things. But I'm thinking this will probably go on the cake table. So that's pretty. And the last thing in this tote is the um, what I will be wearing for that day. So got to make sure I smell good and my bow renewal. Um, the small one isn't in there because I'm using that currently. But um, this is what I will be using the day of. Enrico was like, you saving that whole thing for? I sure am. I'm saving this 
for the vow renewal and then once i use it at the vow renewal i would just use it on our trip because after the vow renewal we will be going to disney world and we will be going on a disney cruise so i'm super super excited um that's my first tote and i'm gonna go ahead and show you what's in the next box okay so in this box i just put the basically stuff that wouldn't fit in that one um i'm in the middle of making my bridesmaid bouquets I got these flowers from Hobby Lobby and these are just some stuff we picked up at the Disney store for the um, for the girls to wear to our Disney World trip so and I love it it was so cute we got them from the Disney store and it says born amazing born amazing and those were $14.95 each I got one for Jalen and one for Rikayla because the boys have tons of Spider-Man stuff. So we'll probably all wear Spider-Man shirts on one of those days that we're in Disney. And then I got these. They were on clearance at the Disney store for $7.99. So just some cute little, they're nightgowns for the girls. So I got one for Kayla and one for Jalen. Hers looks huge. So that's pretty much all that's in that box so far. Yes, who is at my door? Lisa. Everybody. <laughs> yes. A nice flowers. Thank you. A bubble. Yes, flowers. All right, so I had to stop and get the kids back situated. This is just um, my little planning thing that I was using before I. Now I use a binder, but this is just what I used before I had the binder. Okay, so these are, um, as you can see, I was using these. I had these to basically make the bottles of the bridesmaid bouquets. So that's, these are those. And I just put those together myself. Not bad. I mean, it's not beautiful, but it's... <laughs> It's not bad, you know, people can't see it close up. So I think far away, they'll be really, really pretty. So I just bought the flowers from Hobby Lobby. Um, the color goes great with pretty much the colors that we have. Um, even though this is, I mean, it's not really a damask look. I mean, it kind of is, but um, that's what I got to basically just wrap them up. So I've made four. I need to make one more. And then um, for my bouquet, I will be ordering it off of Etsy because I want mine to be beautiful. <laughs> more beautiful than I can than I can do. So and then next we have this, which is the cake topper. Um, I still have it wrapped up just to keep it safe. It says we still do and it has it says since 2008 on it so that's our cake topper and I'm just getting super duper excited the more the more I talk about it <laughs> all right and let's see what else we have I have these bags that say thank you for sharing our special day and this will just be used um, to put the gifts in for our um, wedding party the gifts that I will be giving for them so and let's see so yeah these are basically for the gifts for the wedding parties that I will be getting hopefully they will fit because some of the things I want to get hmm might not fit but that's what I have for that um this is the ring bearers pillow which Harley is my ring bearer you just saw him coming in here he's one of my daycare kids but he thinks he's a part of our family which he is actually becoming <laughs> um I just picked these up from party city I really don't know what I'm going to do with them I thought of getting them as favors, but they they're they just cost too much for me to get 
everybody. So I'll probably just put these on one of the tables, maybe the cake table or the um, candy buffet table or the table that Rico and I will be sitting at. And I just got these. These are just heart-shaped mints. I might put these in the gift. Um, I might get more and put them in the gift thing. And that might be what I do with these two. I'm not sure. These are the plates for the cake. So cake table, these plates will be there for the cake table. And I got these from Party City. I'm not sure how much they were because I probably bought them a year or two ago. Um, I have been planning this for a very long time. So, oh, that does match nicely. I was thinking that wouldn't match. Okay, everything is coming together so nicely. I'm super excited. So, these are for the cake. And I have this in here and I'm thinking I have it in there for a reason. Oh, this is, don't tell Rico, but this is the card that I'm going to give him the day of, and I forgot this was in here. So the day of, this is the card that I'm going to give him. It says, you'll always be the man I love. And it is beautiful kind of goes with the same thing it says happy anniversary which it will be our 10 year anniversary so it's just really really beautiful when I saw it I was like oh no I have to get that so I keep it in here to keep it from getting I don't want it to get hurt <laughs> before February comes and even though our anniversary is technically March 4th um the cruise leaves out on March 3rd, so I had to push it back. Push it back a week. So our vow renewal will be happening March 24th. Okay, so that's the card I got for him. My mom found these cute little lamps at Dollar Tree, and we cannot find any more. So these will probably just go on the table that Rico and I will be sitting at. I got these for my invitations that I will be sending out. These are from Hobby Lobby for $1.99. They just have these on the back. And more napkins for the cake table. I even got a few that says happy anniversary. And the other one says, love always and forever. Okay. And I got this thing used off of Facebook. <laughs> I'm going to have to liven it up. But it's basically a card box. And people just put their cards in there. Um, it opens up like this, which is really, really cute. I got these tissues that I will be giving to my bridesmaids probably in their bags those will go and of course save a few for myself I got these from Oriental Trading Oriental Trading is awesome I got my rose petals from Oriental Trading so they say love on it I got white ones and blue ones and it's lighter blue than the blue that I needed but it'll work and we also have these things bride and groom that goes on the back of our chairs and i got that used from the same person i got the box from so i'm gonna put those back in there and i have just been slowly purchasing items basically for the past two to three years i have been planning this we wanted to do it for our fifth anniversary but we were still in the beginning stages of getting our lives together and just you know we had an apartment then we have a house now so it was just a lot of stuff that we had to get moving before we were able to afford this this is my swatch for my dress i got my dress i ordered my dress from wedding dress fantasy and this is the color that it will be so i use this when i'm basically you know looking for the blue that I need so it can go with my dress is this is more more of a turquoise color 
which is this is more of a Tiffany blue color but they're about as close as I'm going to get my dress should be here at the end of August or I think she's sending it out at the end of August so it will be here hopefully sometime soon the this is also for the kids room just some placemats I'm gonna put on the tables for them to have something fun to work on but we'll also have games and all kind of fun stuff for them all right and the last thing I have so far is one of the flower girl baskets oh you know what I will show you Jalen's dress too hers is the only one we have so far this is the flower girl basket and it is beautiful I got it off of Etsy for about $40 and um, I just ordered the second one and I've just been ordering stuff little by little so that's the flower girl basket and I'm gonna run and get Jalen's dress and show you Jalen's dress she is one of my um, junior bridesmaids and I have two junior bridesmaids so the other one has her dress at home all right so this is Jalen's dress she is a junior bridesmaid it is beautiful I just uh I got this from Amazon um I found it on another website and for some reason when I went back to get it it was gone and so I looked everywhere for it and could not find it and one day all of a sudden it just popped up in my suggestions for Amazon so I hurried up and ordered it as soon as I could because I was too afraid that they would not have it again so this is her dress it is beautiful I just ordered Rikayla's dress from Etsy so hers is being made and um, her should come in probably in the next three or four weeks as well so when all of that comes in my dress Rikayla's dress um, our invitations I will do another video show you guys what else I have but that is it so um, this video was a lot longer than I wanted it to be but um, um, like the video subscribe to our channel and we hope to see you guys later bye